Hello everybody, welcome to the chocolate edition of Cooking for Health. And what, what I'm gonna make for you now is the antidote to probably my favorite thing in the world to make as a kid. The cool thing is, you're gonna make it heart healthy. It can increase the, the vasculature into your heart to bring more nutrients to the heart tissue. Huge, just huge for you. If you have some of that box pudding in your house, the gross, nasty, it's got like the artificial colors in it. Dude, why would you, why would you do, th I look at the ingredients on the back of those things and I'm like, this is a freak show, man. You do not want to put that in your mouth. But if you have it, make this beside that and see how they taste together because then you will never go back. There is nothing that is so wonderful in this world. There's nothing that's so excellent on this planet that we people can't totally screw it up. And that includes chocolate. There, are, you can over sugar it and make it bad. You got plenty of sweet. I'm just telling you, if you like powdered sugar, I love you. You know I love you, but you don't need powdered sugar on there. Those things that people put in something that should be so wonderful that actually make it kind of gross. You know, there's a difference between being a cook and being a chef. You don't have to be a chef. You just have to make great food, everyday food, every day. But you know what? Me and you and my mom, normal people, we can make good food right at home. Don't sweat it. You don't have to be a chef. Just cook good food at your house. That's all you need to do. That, my friends, is to live for. It's funny how things change. It used to be that a long time ago that cooking was seen to be something that you had to do. It's a chore. You have to do it. But then once we, once we went out and we stopped cooking and we forgot, forgot how to cook in a standard kitchen, then now we, we, when we make food, we have to eat out because we don't know what to do there. Used to, we could decide, we could choose. Do I eat in? Do I eat out? Because I know what to do here or I could go out. It's your choice. But once you lose that knowledge, you lose the freedom. It empowers you. It releases you from having to have to have to have decisions made for you about where you're going to eat. Now you get to decide. 